Hey guys, what's up? Today we are going to design a concrete, simple concrete bridge having a span of 20 meter and a height of 6 meter. So for this, as usual, open a new project. Select space, name what you want. I'm going to concrete bridge 2. Okay. Add beam and finish. Fine. Select snap node beam, edit plane, exit plane. Length is 20 meter. Select in x direction 20 meter. And uh, breadth is 5 meter. So select is. Five meter, okay. Okay, fine. Going to draw one, one meter, two meter, three, four, and five. Fine. So click on stamp node beam. Click on plate cursor. Select this plate. Control C, Control V. In X direction, five meter. Enter. Again, control V, X direction, 10 meters. I am putting every column in at every 5 meters. That's why I am doing this. In control V and last, 20. I put beam again. Close all this. And click on plate cursor again. Select this, select this plate, control C, control V. In that direction, it's every one meter, enter, control V, Z direction two meter, enter, control V, Z direction three meter, enter, control V, Z direction four meter, enter, control V, Z direction five meter, enter. Okay, I am going to put a column at 1 meter here and a here. Okay, 2 column is enough, I think. So select node cursor, select this node and this node. See, as usual, select this node and this node. Same, select this node and this node. For this, select this node and this node. Select this node and this node. Okay. Click on transactional repeat. Y direction is height is minus six meter. Minus is because because we're going going out downward in Y direction. That's why. Click on link step. Okay. See, it's come. Okay. Then create a plate over. So click on add four node plates. Add. Click all corners for nodes so we can click create a slab here. Okay, fine. See in 3D, you can see that. See, okay. Now click on journal. We are going to assign support. Create, click on create, add, fix support, add. Click on front view. Select support, select all bottom nodes. See, I have selected all bottom nodes. Assign. Assign to selected node. Assign. Assign. Fine. Then click on property. Define. I am going to take a slab thickness of 300 mm. Okay. And a column. Diameter of 600 mm, okay, and a beam size of 300 by 300, okay. Close, and I'm taking thickness of slab is 300 mm, 300, enter, close. <coughs> then I'm going to assign plate thickness, assign to view, assign. Okay, 
column of 3 and 600 mm click on front view select all columns see okay assign to selected sign okay going to beam assign to view assign fine see in 3d now we have assign in okay now we are going to design fine so click on load click on load case Yes. click on load case detail add firstly dead load so i'm going to dead load dl second select live load i'm going to create ll live load close okay click on dead load add we all know dead, dead load means self self it only okay self it wide our direction add close live load add click on plate loads i am going to assume minus 10 kilonewton per meter local will be y add close self it going assign to view assign yes live load assign to view assign ok now we are going to design our design is completed and go, now we are going to analyze click on analyze no print add close Analyze, run analyze, save, see. You can see that zero error, zero warning, and zero notes means our structure is designed successfully. Click on go to post post processing mode. Done. Select all node load. Okay. You can see the reaction. Okay. This is the reaction at every support X, Y, Z. Okay. Fine. You can see the displacement. Okay. This is the displacement by pressing control. You can see that. By pressing control, you can see that this is the dis displacement. Okay. Fine. You can see the animation view. Okay. Fine. See, so click on beam. Okay. This is the beam reaction. Okay. Bending moment diagram. Okay. That's all about a simple bridge of having a span of 20 meter and width of uh, 5 meters. So, thank you for watching. Stay updated. Stay tuned. Thank you.